Greetings, everyone. Today we are watching the unknown and ancient story of the Anasazi people of America. Here are the Anasazi living a peaceful life in Mali, West Africa, before the Arabs violently forced Islam on their way of life. We have come bringing our God to you. No, we love our peaceful way. We do not want to abandon our great ancestors for your violent gods. You have until the end of this week to worship our gods. If you do not, we will kill you all. It is time for us to leave our motherland and travel to the land across. The land of our brothers. Prepare the ships. We must go to America. The Malayans, who were also known as the Telum, left Mali, their home, and traveled to America as many of their ancestors did before them. They settled in what is called the Four Corners area, known today as Arizona, New Mexico, Colorado, and Utah. How are you able to have food all year long? We use granaries. These are containers that store our food in between harvest. That way we always have food to eat. Here, let me teach you. How is it that you have fresh water all the time? We have a rain reservoir. As you can see, the landscape of our dwelling allows for water to flow to all necessary areas of the land. Here, let me teach you. The Anasazi lived peacefully with some of the African and Asian mixed tribes that were living in that area and taught food preservation, building, irrigation, and even certain arts to the natives. As always, in time, violent people forced the Anasazi to move again. We want this land, and we will kill you to take it. Give us all you have or die. Again, the Anasazi moved, and this time they joined the many other African tribes from West Africa that were living here peacefully in America, like the Yamasi and the Washita tribes. 